It was the height of summer in 2009. An orange-colored wave hit sultry Korea. This is Boryong City, Chungtong Namdo Province, famous for its Boryong Mud Festival. Wow, it's awesome! A street parade that cuts across the heart of the city. There is even known to be another hidden jewel at the end of that. Koreans and tourists join in with the fun in the mud. The excitement grows as the festival gets started. So now, let's all plunge deep into the fascinating Boryong Mud Festival. Daejeon Beach, the biggest on the west coast. You can't help but feel the excitement swirling around. Plunge into mud, roll over, and enjoy it all. The entire Daejeon Beach is covered in mud. If you want to experience the world-famous mud, first plunge into a mud bath, and then plunge in again. Every person in the global village, men, women, old and young, become immersed in the world of mud. When you dive into the mud, known to be good for your skin, all barriers from racial to language disappear, with a childlike innocence filling its place. Sink into the mud and roll over. Yes, yes. In the large mud bath, formalities and reputations are done away with, and people show their true inner selves. This festival is the perfect event to share with family, friends, and your significant other. So wonderful, so cool. I love it. Korean melodies played during the mud festival provide that extra touch of excitement to overseas tourists. The Conquering Mud Peak competition is suitable for everyone, no matter if you are young or old, male or female. Everyone just slips and slips. Reaching the Mud Peak is more satisfying than reaching the top of the Himalayas. Where else can you experience this kind of happiness? The slickness of mud that is good for the skin plays its part here too. Run for it, run! Ringing the mud bell as quickly as possible. You're falling back, back and back. Over you go, onto your bottom. You are covered from head to toe in mud, but you're still enjoying yourself. Okay, I really enjoyed that and I had a lot of fun, but even though I couldn't get it, it was really nice and thank you, it's really a nice festival. Mud Prison, where mud is sprayed constantly. Help me, help me. With a loved one, even the mud prison is not to be feared. There is only romance and thrill. It's also the perfect place for taking souvenir pictures. I beg your pardon? Mud rain falls down from the tunnel. Just leave your body to the cool mud water and your stress will be eliminated. Really, it will. And that's not all. There is also a mud super slide that doubles the thrill. A mud couple slide which you can slide down while holding a loved one or friend's hand and more. Freshness that comes after familiarity. You're totally psyched. It's so exciting that I'll be out of breath if I say it again. Boryong Mud Festival is the place that brings families, lovers, and friends together as one. But wait, there's more. Various events take place all around the festival so that you can make special memories at Boryong Mud Festival. Mud Mob Scene, where you throw away formalities and dignity and try to get as messy as possible and increase the fun. Leave your entire body to the mud, from the top of your head to the tips of your toes, and your body and mind will thank you for it. Following the mob scene, you will want to relax with a self-massage at the beach. It's good for your skin, so don't miss a spot. The rich and fresh colors of the mud join together in harmony. Tourists from all over the world are charmed by the colorful mud. You like what you see, and your body likes it too. So just imagine what it will do for your mood. Awesome. I like being blue. When you get close to the festival, the sight of a vast mud flat stretches out before you. Well-being mud flat experience, which takes place in the clean and pure mud flat of the west coast. Mud throwing and mock cavalry battles, along with Marine Corps style extreme guerrilla training, bring you closer to the mud. Run on the mud flat barefooted and enjoy an array of sports. Before you know it, your entire body is covered in mud. But it's still fun. This is the Well-Being Festival of Korea. Wow. <laughs> this mud feels fantastic on my skin. I recommend it. <laughs>
If you're feeling tired physically from the Mud Show, let's take a breather in the Mud Skin Care Center. You can check out various mud cosmetics which are good for your skin, and you can experience the special qualities of mud through a mud massage, sauna, and so forth. Boryong mud is rich in germanium, bentonite, and other various minerals, which makes it especially effective for smoothing your skin and preventing its aging. When you go to the Boryong Mud Festival, you mingle in amid so many overseas tourists that you end up thinking, am I still in Korea? There are systematic services for tourists in place, true to its name of a representative festival of Korea. Information services will not let you down. They provide expert interpreters for those who need the help. Food zones and various facilities help overseas tourists to enjoy the festival to its fullest. Boryong Mud Festival has become Korea's representative festival in which the greatest number of foreigners take part. They say that it didn't become what it is today in a single step. The international forum in which prominent festival officials take part is providing the foundation for Boryong Mud Festival to make the leap to being a global festival. What is not to like about the mud dress? Where else can you get dirty and have fun at the same time? This is fantastic. Yo. A place for discussing the export of Boryong Cosmetics, known for their quality, has been established, and this is seeking ways to penetrate the overseas markets even more. In addition, a World Mud Skin Cosmetic Treatment Contest has been held, and not only have Korean stars been recruited as publicity ambassadors, but international stars from countries like Japan and China also take part in an effort to inform the world about Boryong Mud Festival. It's a mistake to think that the festival is over just because the sun has set. The festival gets underway again with colorful fireworks. Starting with international superstar Rain, performances by top stars from Korea, China and Japan keep the festival alive in the evenings. A free stage that unites Korean culture and different cultures from around the world unfolds every night like a relay. And if that's not enough, hip-hop and global rave parties where you can dance to the music and be totally free from it all start at dusk and continue on until daybreak, heating up the night at Daejeon Beach. This is what Boryong Mud Festival is all about, everyone uniting. They say that Boryong Mud Festival has made its way into China, the world's most populous country with its vast territory. And in China, it is called Gum Sok Tan, Korea Boryong Mud Festival. Since its opening ceremony, crowds of people have taken part, including overseas journalists, hinting at its great success. Tourists are flocking to enjoy the mud experiences such as mud sliding and the mud bath installed along the coast of Gumsok Tan Beach. Are you enjoying yourself? The Boryong Mud Festival in China clearly shows that the festival has surpassed simply being a representative festival of Korea and has now become a world festival. More delightful and with even more spirit, Boryong Mud Festival, where you plunge deep into mud, roll over and enjoy yourself. The place of fun and excitement shared together with people from all over the world. The place filled with delightful energy that transforms lives. This place is none other than Boryong Mud Festival, a fascinating tourist destination in Korea. <laughs>